Across the world, women are working for peace. Though they are from different countries, cultures, and generations, they have a few things in common. They are all courageous. Being a displaced person in Sudan during those days, it was not easy. And we know the suffering that comes with conflict. I had to struggle a lot for my education. I remember uh, I was being threatened to be killed, shot dead by my uncles because I was not uh, giving up going to school. I grew up in a low-income family. I saw my mother convincing all the men in the village not to commit crimes. They are all committed. For about 40 years, I worked on women's rights and gender equality. I was uh, among the first ladies in my village to attend the university. I stood in front of every man member of my family, which was so difficult. And I said, my brothers are not going to be into all these firings and killing. And they are each making change. The work that we do is to ensure that women have the space to contribute in decision making. You can't have participation and perspectives and all that without transforming the entire system. We are not alone. We are also part of a global incredible movement because we are not only changing our, our countries, we are trying to change the world. If you know a woman who is making a lasting impact in a country affected by conflict or crisis, visit usip.org slash womenbuildingpeace to nominate them for the second annual Women Building Peace Award. Their work deserves our recognition and support. Submit your nomination today.